Okay, so you're fired up or you could care less about the Starbucks controversy. Well, let's get to the meat and potatoes of this debate. Can you breach a door with a Frappuccino? First up, I'm putting your standard particle board door up against Starbucks Finest by doing a deck cord wrap for my charge. But that's not all. In case you're hell-bent on boycotting the demon from Seattle, have no fear. Black Rifle Coffee, a veteran-owned company, is here to deliver more punch to knock the balls off the steel door I set up. Using my personal favorite roast, Silencer Smooth, I filled up a breaching bladder and placed some C4 and deck cord to give the door the little extra push it needs. And if you're looking for an awesome stocking stuffer, Black Rifle Coffee has you covered too. AK-47 Espresso, Gunship, Sniper's Hide, all kinds of cool names to complement some amazing flavors. Even the new K-Cups come in an ammo can, so nothing says Christmas like caffeine at 28,000 feet per second. So let's get the blasting. What's happening, guys? Me and Pete are out at the range. Say hi. Hello. <laughs> it's about 100 degrees here in Alabama. It's hot. I'm doing something a little cool. I'm do some breaching with Starbucks and deck cord. Got some of this stuff right here take a quick look at that now realistically this has no practical application the door is on a makeshift frame here and honestly any shift in the door or the frame itself would cause the door to open I just wanted to show you guys what a little bit of deck cord and a little bit of Starbucks can do realistically speaking this is not an actual legit scientific representation of breaching something so don't get your panties in a wall and say, oh that's not that's not that's not structurally like sound you can't uh, oh look at that look at that door shut up So this first shot, the door is still standing up here. And uh, part of the reason for that is because the way that I put the stand, uh, whenever the door blew open, instead of going all the way open, it's actually going up to a hill here. So uh, that kept the door from falling down generally. If I have one of these charges that I'll do on a freestanding frame or something like that, it'll knock the whole thing down. But uh, yeah, so it's pretty cool to see this thing standing up here. If you look at the hole on the door, uh, I thought that the door would actually be more wrecked than it is, so I can speculate all day long, but uh, yeah, let's just look at the slow-mo on it. Smells like caffeine. That's what a little bit of deck cord. The breaching bladder and some black rifle coffee will do. <laughs> Crops were good this year.